Hi, this is Michael, and this is my review of the Linksys EA3500 dual-band router with gigabit and USB. And that's just scratching the surface of what this router can do. Uh, this is almost at the very top of the heap as far as consumer routers that Linksys is making for 2012. And uh, it's very feature-rich and performs very well. Let me just show you the rest of the box here. I've been using Linksys products for many years. Uh, I've used the WRT54Gs, the various, several various versions of that router, and that uh, to me was kind of a real workhorse in the Linksys line. It's been around forever and works very well. Um, it's a little dated now, and these are the routers that are replacing it. So here is the power supply. A little bit larger than some of the lower end routers that I've had in the past, but it's not huge. It does come with an Ethernet cable. And this is the setup CD. And you do want to use the setup CD because it really does make setup a breeze. Uh, it works equally well on the Mac as it does for the PC. So here's the router itself. What I like about the, one of the things I like about the new design of routers is no longer do we have to contend with ungainly antennas sticking out from behind. Uh, all your antennas are inside the router. Also, it's a very clean look. There are no status display LEDs flashing or blinking on the front panel here. In fact, uh, the only LEDs are going to be on the back of the router and they are going to show you network activity but you're not going to have to look at it all day long so you've got a four port switch here this is a gigabit you also have a USB connector here this is great if you have um, a network attack attached storage you can plug it in right there and uh, then this is the this is the quick setup button here here's your reset switch and there's your AC adapter plug-in Performance has been phenomenal with this router. Uh, I live in a 2,000 square foot house. I have the router up on the second floor in my office and I'm able to get a very good, solid, strong signal throughout the entire house. Uh, so no complaints there. I've had no dropouts with this router since I've had it working. And um, with all the other features, I have not yet attached a network drive to it, but I'm looking forward to doing that soon. Um, I think for the money, you're getting a lot of router here for the money. And I think it's going to perform quite well for uh, just about anybody who gets this router. Now, if you don't need all the bells and whistles that this router uh, has, you may want to consider one of the lower end mo models. Uh, you could even consider the E900, which is just a very basic router. But um, if you want dual band and you want uh, the gigabit and you want the USB and all the other features that this router has, then this is the baby to get. It does support IPv6 as well as IPv4, and uh, I think it's just wonderful. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. I'll answer it if I can. Otherwise, thanks for watching and have a great day. I, I will just mention briefly also that the setup will take about five minutes, so it's uh, not an extremely long period of time either. You'll be up and running in no time. Take care.